good morning everyone it's 8 a.m i'm here on the beach in viva barria and today i'm doing a really really nice intense workout involving two pieces of equipment battle rope but you're not gonna use it as a battle rope you're gonna use it as a dragon rope and two pairs of 12 kg kettlebells you attach the the ends of the rope to a kettlebell and then you drag it from here to the end of the beach and come back make sure to have plenty of water with you because the sun outside is strong and you need to stay, stay hydrated as much as possible let's give it a try <laughs> I'm not even half yet. I'm spitting my lungs out, my quads, and my calves. Massacre in pieces. Look at the truth. I reached the end of the beach made the u-turn and i'm going again all the way there it was such a bad idea honestly guys it gets such a mental and physical tiredness level already that i have to motivate myself somehow and set those small benchmarks so i'm reaching one point i take my water bottle I walk 30 meters in the front of me. I put the water bottle on the sand and I have to reach the water bottle level to take a sip of water and continue going and still the journey so far. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm done with the drag. A couple of things to keep in mind before attempting this. The rope really cuts in the arm. So if you're sensitive skin, please wear a long sleeve or something. I don't mind, but it was actually getting a bit annoying towards the end. Technique wise, if you do pull the rope, putting it over your shoulder and you want to add a bit of extra resistance for your triceps, you can actually put your hands towards you and create that angle here and you will work out on your triceps as well, as well as you will work up on your shoulder. Very nice tip. If your upper body is tired and my body was tired when I reached the end, I just pulled the rope more on my chest and I was just locking it with my thumbs so it doesn't slip down. And when this became annoying as well, towards the very end from the last letter to the last letter, so approximately 70 meters, I was just dragging the rope by putting it over my pelvis over here. This way I'm removing any kind of resistance from my upper body. My core is not as involved, my lower back is not as involved, my hands are resting completely. And I'm just dragging it, putting a complete disaster impact on my quads. I could feel my quads in the last 70 meters more than I could feel my, feel my quads in a whole journey itself. So it has been a very nice uh, test drag. If you ever feel like joining the same uh, course, feel free to send me a text here on YouTube or follow me on Instagram, which is the same, do it like Andre. Stay in good health and take care of yourself.